Yeah, so version history uh, is basically what the name says. It's like a list with all the changes you make throughout the project. So you can go through it, and if you want to undo and go back, you can simply click on the actual uh, like action and go back. And the Figma will basically go back to the way things were in like at that point exactly. Um, as far as I know, you have 30 days version history in the free Figma, and I think unlimited version history with the paid subscription. Uh, to access it, you click on this drop-down arrow and show version history, and yeah, it actually is 30 days. Um, and if you want to like undo, you simply click on one, and uh, you should have all the past layers. Actually, okay, let let me see if I can. Okay, let's create a few actions. Okay, now let's go to version history. Uh, yeah, you can see that my shapes disappeared and uh, this was like the layout I did a few minutes ago, like 30 minutes ago, okay. Uh, to create a new version history, you can add the plus. I click on the plus icon uh, and some of the version histories are created you can see automatically at once every couple of minutes probably 30 minutes as far as I know uh, but it probably will depend on the actually the actual changes you make in the project I'm, I'm not exactly sure how it works but you can see there are auto saved and you can also manually create like version history uh, so yeah, that's how you use it and that's how you access it in Figma.